Today, I want to talk to you about something that a lot of us dream about having and set as a benchmark to success, luxury cars. When we talk about luxury cars, we imagine the successful millionaires owning it. But surprisingly, that's not the case in India. Data shows that India has over 2 lakh millionaires, but only 21,400 luxury cars were sold in 2020. Makes you wonder why, right? This is after a 37% drop from 2019, and India constitutes only 1% of the luxury car market. To give you an understanding, the market size of luxury cars in India is about $1 billion, while in China, which constitutes about 13% of the world's luxury car market, is about 160 billion, 160 times the size of India. The leader of luxury cars in India is Mercedes-Benz with a growth of about 42.5% every year, followed by BMW which has a growth of about 35% every year. 2021 did show a recovery in the luxury car market with it reaching pre-COVID numbers, mainly due to the pent-up demand due to the lockdown and of course the new model release. But the main issue with the luxury car market is the enormous amount of import duty that is applied to these cars because most of them come from outside the country. The GSC as well is very high. For comparison, Mercedes-Benz GLA in India costs about 45 lakhs, while in China it costs less than 28 lakhs. This is because more than 50% GST is applied to these cars and the import duty ranges from 60 to 100% on the cost insurance freight value. Pre-owned luxury cars are also a segment that plays an important role. Indians prefer buying pre-owned cars because it is cheaper than the actual cost and mostly in great condition. Maybe if the government decides to bring down these costs and the prices of these cars go down, more Indians would prefer buying. Tell us in the comment section what you think about it.